Hello and welcome back to episode 26 of Better Than Napoleon, where we're playing as France in the U4 1.34 update and aiming for the Better Than Napoleon achievement. Um, we are quite large at this point, as you can see. We also have, um, if you look at the player map mode, good chunk of this, good chunk of the New World, pretty much all of South America. North America, a little bit more rough because there's so many natives. We'll deal with them at some point, maybe. I don't, I don't even know if I really care to mess with the New World too much beyond what my um, subjects have already acquired. So, in the last episode, we subjugated Poland. Uh, we are working on getting them loyal. Um, I am going to be integrating Rigas soon. I took away their march status. In due time, that will happen. Um, but we also called a crusade against the Ottomans, so we have a few options to expand. Uh, first off, Polish subjects. Primary owner is Polish subject of France. Owner of Warsaw gets permanent claim on the Polish region. Yeah, I think I already took Warsaw. Yep, I did. That's not a big deal. I don't really need the Russian campaign at all. I will get to there in due time. Uh, we'll probably just annex Pol Poland, like whatever. It's not a big deal. Just wanted to get that subjugation on them because I was hoping I would keep the PU on Hungary. I didn't think it would happen, though. I was pretty sure it, I was, I was pretty sure it wouldn't, but I was hopeful that I would. I was hoping I was remembering it wrong, and obviously I wasn't. Um, we are going to get our armies in order. I'm just going to take that. I'm not going to deal with some random rebels. I don't care enough to. Uh, we are going to attack Siena for Nizza, Genoa, and Albania. And we could even give Luca and Pisa to Naples if we wish. Uh, we'll go ahead and call Bohemia in. If we co Venice, we could also co the Knights. I don't think I'm going to co them. I might even take the Knights and Trent in this war, so... Let's do that. You can pounce right on these armies. Uh, you need a leader, huh? I don't think there's any free ones, so we'll recruit some. Let's get two recruited so we have them. Uh, you can go ahead and land on Rhodes. We'll get the Knights under our control. Um, other issues. How about all of you guys, except you... Start working on the Venetians. Okay, and there we go. Fair dealing, lose a corruption, gain a bunch of that. How's our corruption doing? Wow, we're at... Seven corruption, huh? Wow. Okay, wasn't really paying attention to that. Let's get that bought down. So it's going to cost us some ducats in the short term, but we'll buy it down real fast. Not a big deal. Corruption running rampant in France, not that big of an issue, right? All right, and our subjects are working on all that stuff. We've taken out a loan. That's fine. We'll deal with it. We'll get it paid off in due time. We'll continue converting provinces as we can. Uh, times of need. Definitely would like... Let's ask them for military aid. That's fine. Uh, conversion successful. Very good. We can continue converting. Um, all of you guys, why are you all piled up down here when I told you to head this way?
Um, we want to blockade you guys, so get over here. 25 military power, thank you very much, Teutons. Polish Liberty Desire is dropping. You gotta be careful with that uh, subjugation CB on Poland. If you are um, subjugating a massive commonwealth, you will not be able to keep them under control. No matter how many bonuses you stack. So basically you just have a, a subject that is pretty much just costing you a diplo spot and could cause a uh, big war against you if they wished. Normally, by the time you get the CB in France games, it's not too much of an issue, but it could be. Austria is going to attack Hungary. Uh, innovativeness, I don't need. We'll take the prestige and legitimacy. Yeah, I'm definitely going to annex these OPMs in this war. Just to get them out of the way. Prevent them from joining future coalitions. And it doesn't cost us that much to do it, so why, why not, right? Okay, you'll give us roads and all your money. Good enough for me. We'll take it. Go ahead and core up roads. Uh, Trent and Venice. Go ahead and blow open the walls there. Let's get our fleet... You guys should be going home at war, and uh, you guys can come up here and blockade Venice's main area. Continue our conversions. Uh, must be the fort in Trent stopping me. Blow open the walls. Uh, we'll go for admin efficiency, probably. Or, well, we could go for more absolutism. I don't think that'd be too much of an issue. We could start looking to push for court and country. We'd have to lower our stability quite a bit, actually. Uh, let's just go for the admin efficiency for now. Probably the better option right now for us. And if we just push it down. There we go. Perfect. Okay, my subjects will handle their army. We can... Peace out, Trent. And we'll annex them as well. As soon as they'll let us. I will need to keep doing what we can do to boost up our relations with Poland. Okay, Fran or Venice has now been full sieged. I'm not going to take anything from them in this war. We're just going to take all their money and their war reps. If I annex Trent, maybe I can get their war power too. Not a big deal, but it could help a little bit. Why not? Um, let's try it. If they'll go for it right now, they will not. So that's going to take us a minute. Instead, yeah, let's just peace you out, take your money and war reps. 
And uh, that sounds good to me. Well, let's get our entire army prepared for a war with the Ottomans. Who are you at war with, huh? Hungary. So the Austrians... Oh, I thought the, it was the Ottomans that attacked them. I just thought it was the Austrians that did. Um, if I can just take that province in this peace deal, I'm going to do it. So, one, two, three. Uh, we're going to take Trent for ourselves. We're going to go ahead and give Luca and... I'm just going to give these guys to Florence. Where are you at, Florence? There you are. Florence and Florence. Um, I'm just going to let them handle coring it and then I'll get them integrated later and Corsica as well and then a touch of money thank you very much for all of that we will get those cores going and we can take Annex Genoa Once we annex Switzerland, that'll be good for our army professionalism. I don't know if that's a real um, I don't think that's a real we need to get that done immediately type deal. So, okay. Armies are all making their way back to the Balkans. We are going to be going to war with the Ottomans. Well, we could attack you and cobligerate you. Even like call in Bohemia. I don't know if I want to, though. I don't know if that's really worth my time at the moment. We can go ahead and repay our loans. So that is taken care of. Uh, we should make sure that we are increasing with subject countries and maybe even outrage countries. Oh, and we need to look into who we can annex. So if I annex Florence at this point, they won't have these cord. We are annexing Portugal still, so if I do a double annex, it's going to cost us, so no, never mind on that. I am going to need to be careful with my unjustified demands then. I wasn't thinking about that. Now we can go ahead and summon a diet, and we'll take whichever is best for us. We could go for Fez. Free claims is good. All the way over there, man. Okay. If I do this overextension one... Yeah, sure, we'll do that. Okay. And then we can look to revoke something else, maybe? No, not quite yet. Don't want to revoke the integration policy while I'm integrating... We are at 65 absolutism at the moment. It's pretty good. Not bad. Could be worse. Alright, and we have a holy war to get to, so let's get to it. Bohemia will join. Sure, let's bring in Bohemia too. Just make it easier on us. Uh, we are going to Yeah, 
Yeah, we're going to just immediately pounce on whatever armies we can. I need to get my fleet. Um, they are repairing. They're going to stand in the straits and they can repair their damaged ships. That'll just stop the Ottomans from crossing here. Crusade effect will trigger on us, giving us a lot of bonuses. We lost another general. Not surprising. I'm going to get a bit of my army more together, and then we can pounce on this large Ottoman army. Oh! Throne inherited. King is dead. Empress Regency. Inheriting the throne of Naples is huge. Go ahead and get you all unified here. Do this. Uh, we need... Oh, we're still dealing with this corruption. That's right. Okay, navally... Could probably divide this navy up at this point. Once you guys join this privateer fleet, and you should probably be privateering like Aleppo. Oh, I am just melting my army up there, huh? that fleet up, do another conversion, losing 20 ducats a month at the moment. Sixteen thirty-four, two years, is it worth it for us to get rid of religious diplomats? It's Ten more absolutism. And drop off of those guys, and then you can get position in all kinds of sieges. Um, I will just lose the stability, that's fine. Oh, the Shiravan has come all the way over here, as have the Ottomans.
looks like some of my subjects are broken, so I need to restart the save after this episode. It's almost over, so though, so I'll just deal with it for the time being. We are ahead of time on text, so no worries there. Polish liberty desire. Come on, Poland. Don't you want to be friends? Don't you want to be friends? Let's go ahead and placate them again. Gain of stability and admin tech cost or 50 prestige. Uh, I'm going to do the 50 prestige because, like I said, I'm thinking about going for court and country. It might help a little bit. Uh, we'll use that excess prestige then to placate you guys. I'm just going to placate them to being loyal. We'll take the prestige. Keep pushing all of our soldiers into position. Um, whatever, that's fine. Slowly getting our corruption down. It's costing us a little bit, but we'll get it down. It's fine. Let's go ahead and spend a bunch of points trying to keep Papal Controller. That siege is over real quick like uh, we'll get off of you and you and then oh no no you stay there we wanted there we go can't go there let's get on to every province that you can get on to huh Continuing to take sieges very easily. We can head on down to... See, Bohemia's already on there. Let's get... Um, hold on. Okay, let's get down here. Over here. Nope, nope. You, you. Uh, you, 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 you. And then you. There we go. Almost time to take tech. Um. Da -da 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 -da. We are crushing the Ottomans again, continuing to push them out of Europe, continuing to push our borders. Making a little bit of money at this point. 
and then losing a bunch of money. Um, I'll just go with the autonomy. Oh, we've taken that siege. Let's get you guys down to here. We've been insulted. We can go ahead and take our next idea group. Um, here, this is going to cost us very little. Um, I'm just going to take it. I don't care. Don't care at this point. Don't really need to. Now let's go for the Diplo power. That siege is over. We can head on to another one. Uh, if there are any more. Not really seeing. Uh, we can go there. Overextension has been reduced. Our cores are done. That's good because we're about to take on a bunch more overextension. Now then, uh, let's see here. I'm going to take both of those provinces. And then, what do we got here? Wallachia still has its cores. I could release a Wallachia. It might be a little worthwhile. Um, there's no cores over here anymore. Yeah, there's no cores over here to release either. That's fine. Um, I don't even know if I want to release the subject, so I don't think I'm gonna. I think maybe we do like that. I'll take Libo. And then... Push them off the coast. We can take here. Keep pushing this way. 98 over extension. That's enough for me. And uh, there we go. Get everything cored up. Boom. And then... Uh, we'll just send someone here. You, you know what? Hold on. Okay. Give me all you guys. Probably going to have some rebel issues, so this isn't a bad idea. Not exactly sure where I want to send my armies to next either. bring you over here crusades over uh, I didn't even look at my AE from that but I mean my AE hasn't grown very much at all outside of yeah no not much at all so I think that's a good place to call this episode so if you like the episode I'd appreciate a like if you really like the episode I would appreciate a subscription and I hope to see you in the next one thank you very very much for watching goodbye